Good day, St. Lucia. I wish everyone a happy No Tobacco Day. As the world celebrates No Tobacco Day every year, I am sure those who have been able to quit the bad addictive habit of smoking have realized a marked improvement in their health and life in general. By giving up smoking, not only do you preserve your quality of health, but you also protect those around you from being exposed to secondhand smoke, which in some instances can be more detrimental to health and life. Also, you improve on your economic situation by saving the finances you spend on smoking. For those who are still addicted and social smokers, mostly our young people, I say to you today, you need to remember that you are not only exposing yourself to a very dangerous killer, but you are exposing others to a potentially harsh death sentence. Non-communicable diseases such as cancers caused by smoking is among the top 10 killers in the world. These preventable diseases are also a heavy burden on our healthcare system, as well as on family who in most cases are not able to afford to pay for treatment and care. So as I wish you happy No Tobacco Day, I am pleased that many people who have kicked the bad habit of smoking can celebrate knowing that they have the fortitude to do so. And for those who have not been able to stop smoking, I urge you to look to the theme this year, which is protecting youth from industry manipulation and preventing them from tobacco and nicotine use, to educate yourselves and reach out to the Substance Abuse Secretariat of the Ministry of Health, where you can get the necessary assistance. Have a smoke-free, no tobacco day.